Well, I'm not doing a video, guys. I'm gonna start doing guitar tutorials. Like, I'm gonna put this in one as first guitar tutorial, and then second and third. Either needs to get a little bit harder, but, um, let's get to it. So, first of all, you need a guitar, obviously, but if you do, you're gonna learn how to tune it to make sure your playing sounds good. I have an app called Guitar Tuner. Go ahead and download that if you want to. It don't take up a lot of space, and it's a free app. You can get it on App Store or Google Play. So, here's the tuning. That one's in tune. I'll, I'll just get it out of tune for y'all. So, tune down a little bit. You just kind of got to play with these tuning pegs right here. The little metal things on top. Every guitar is a little different. So, you just got to play with it. If the numbers start getting lower, that means you're doing good. sound you're in tune. So let's get to the um, guitar stuff. So the name of your strings are E, A, D, G, B, E. The very bottom one, if you're holding the guitar, is your high E. It sounds higher. Then the top is your low E. It kind of looks kind of low. So there's a few sayings. You have elephants and donkeys grow big ears or 88 dynamite goodbye Eddie. So I like the 88 dynamite one better. It's just my favorite. It's easier to remember. So you have E string for Eddie, A string for eight, D string for dynamite, the G string for good, the B string for bye, and the uh, E string on the very the high the high E for Eddie. So now that you know your string name, how to, I'll show y'all some simple chords. I have a little chord chart right here. So a really easy one. It's a small G. So it's just your high E on your third fret. Sounds like this. Simple enough. Well, that's what the small G looks like right there. You can actually draw these out. If you draw like six lines, then you just put your dots. Oh, here's another thing I forgot. So there's these little X's up there. And I, that's how you know not to play them. So you only got to play the three bottom strings. That's how it's supposed to sound, actually. Sorry. So on the next one, you're going to use your high E again, but it's just on the first fret. So there again, there's these little X's, so you can only play the, the bottom three. So it's, so it's going to sound like this. Okay, it's a pretty simple one. So let's get a little bit harder and go to the A. It is, you're going to use three fingers. So you got, um, it's on your, your um, G. B no. Okay, yeah. So this string right here. Sorry guys. Okay. Like that. I want a little more trickier. And then there's another one. It's your E7. So you're just gonna put it on your fourth string. I recommend for your fourth string up here on your first fret. Using your um, pointer finger makes it a little easier. And then you're gonna go to your A, a string on your second on your second fret, and you're just gonna. Man, that doesn't sound too good. The guitar's gonna hurt a lot at first, but you gotta get some calluses after a little bit of play, and you'll get some, and it won't hurt you as bad. So there it is guys, I'll see y'all next time.